Honorable Ministers, distinguished delegates, a very warm welcome to the third ministerial conference on space applications for sustainable development in Asia and the Pacific. The 2030 Agenda presents a unique opportunity to integrate space imagery and geospatial information in the region. We need to proactively engage with a wider group of stakeholders, allowing us to more effectively manage and share knowledge and information. Our region has the potential to achieve a transformation that will serve as a global model on the cooperative use of innovative technology for common good. We thank you for your contributions and support in preparations for this ministerial conference. Let us listen to the voices of our youth. We invite you all to join us and work together. My country is at risk to major earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, floods, droughts and sea level rise. We also face multiple challenges in regard to building capacity, resilience to natural disasters and appropriate skills. Sri Lanka is prone to frequent drought, floods and less. These natural disasters affect our crops and food productivity, reduce agricultural production as well as the livelihood of farms. Climate change is having a huge impact on my country. Disasters have many impacts. For example, we suffer from saltwater intrusion in our rice paddies and farms. Many people are also suffering from poverty as a result of multiple disasters and other challenges. Tajikistan is a hazard point country with floods and landslides. Many of our neighboring countries suffer from similar problems due to our geography. Mongolian country is highly prone to drought into so this very specific to some country of our region. My country Myanmar has been exposed to flash drought and tropical cyclone. We need data and knowledge to improve our decision making process. We need to provide an accurate, timely and accessible information to reach our stakeholders and the community. I'm planning to use the knowledge of remote sensing and GIS and combine it with my IT knowledge and produce a system which will help to save our crops from the drought. We can improve the decision-making process by integrating geospatial data so that accurate, timely and reliable information reaches to the vulnerable communities. We are sponsored by UNSCAP and South South Education Foundation at the Chinese University of Hong Kong. We are sponsored by UNSCAP and the Government of India to study as sisters in Dehradun, India. Important work lies ahead of us. As space leaders, you have gathered to chart a common path forward that will bring the true potential of space applications to its realization in a way that ensures no one is left behind.